Yeah. You can hear her music. Okay guys, so I'm pretty late on the three month update. I do apologize about that because she turned three months on May 5th and it is currently May 18th. <laughs> so pretty late. Um, but she's basically starting to roll over on her side and in her belly and her bassinet and giving me a little bit of a heart attack because I'm afraid she's going to suffocate to death and stuff in the middle of the night, but I keep rolling her back over. And she keeps rolling. I mean, I can't really help it. But she mostly likes sleeping on her left side like her mommy. So she's like her mommy in that category. She's still only drinking five ounces of formula every four hours. Uh, in the middle of the night, she'll have a bottle around 10, 11 o'clock at night. And sometimes she'll wake up at 4 or 5 o'clock to eat. And then sometimes she'll wait till 7. So she's doing a longer stretch on sleeping, which really, really helps me out. Especially with me having to get up at 5 in the morning to go to work and stuff. But we're about to go to summertime. So I'll get my break. And Michael will still be working. You can see her laying over there in the floor. She's so cute. She smiles all the time. She's just a happy baby. She's hardly ever fussy. And I just, I, I love her to death. Like, yeah, I just love her. But I'm really sorry that I was late on this video. I don't know how much space I have on my phone because I have all kinds of pictures on here that I need to put on my other phone so I can have more space on this phone. But I do promise that her four month update will be longer because I'm sure she'll be doing a whole lot more. The only thing that she's really doing different now, like I said, is sleeping longer at night and rolling on her side wanting to sleep and stuff like that I mean so she does she can't be swaddled anymore obviously so I've been try. I bought her some rattles and toys and I've been like shaking them for her and letting her smile and trying to get her interested in it but she ain't really reaching for nothing yet or really interested in grabbing anything other than my finger she'll hang on to my finger and my hands a lot I guess she does that for comfort sorry if I'm talking fast like I said I don't know how much room is in this and I don't know if I'll be able to finish it but I'll show you her one more time I hope I don't get copyrighted because of the music the other kids are listening to but hey baby hey baby hi hi smiley wally how's you doing oh and she is losing a lot of hair on the top and kind of like the middle of the back of her head and keeping her thick hair all around the back of her hairline so I keep picking on Michael saying she's starting to look like a old man haircut but she's still cute I mean she's adorable it is what it is Desiree is really the only one that kept her hair and her hair got thicker Gracelyn and Zaylee now looks like they lost their hair oh she does have cradle cap sorry I had to move that thing but she does have cradle cap and the only other baby that had cradle cap was Jaden my firstborn so it's been a while since I had to deal with that because Desiree and Graceland didn't have it but she gets it pretty bad and I'm constantly putting baby oil on her head and brushing it with a comb to get rid of it and then it'll come right back in like a day or two so that's been a little bit frustrating because it just it makes me feel so bad for it because it makes their heads look so flaky and bad on the top especially with her losing her hair on the top but yeah she don't have as much hair on the top as she did when she was born it's still like all in the main back like the back line of her head and stuff like that but yeah that is the little update i hope you guys like it um my um as you know michael and Jaden do father and son videos and i thought about doing mother and daughter videos but I really don't know what I want to do yet with them. So leave a comment below if you know of anything.